Will you please oh, welcome Gandhi Joe? Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Why wow, you're so quiet tonight? You look like you've never seen a pod before. Anyway, I'm 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 just here to spread some uh, some poetry and, and good lyrics and things like that. Before we get into uh, anything terribly dirty, a uh, piece of uh, piece of work called "Verse in Reverse in Verse." What lurks in the artist of a mind? Compressed, waiting to unwind, expressed by all that it sees, undressed and floating with ease. Pretending to feel everything, intending the exact same thing, bartending the spirit of art from its ending and back to its start. When poetry writes you by verse, your language speaks you in tongues, the air breathes you in lungs, the ocean swims you afloat when music plays you a note, sound hears your ears unwrinkle, round like bells untinkle, untouched yet silently perverse. When your body invites you to dance, space occupies you as you prance, maintaining a lifelong romance, entertaining the inner child that molests you, forgiving the memories that forget you. The creative thinker becomes unbarred, for the questions may answer what's hard for life to live you unscarred. Experience is what happens when the world visits you again and again and again. Vision sees through your eyes. Flavor itself tastes your buds. Aroma and scent smell your nose. Sensation touches through souls. So mind your mind, but don't let the rest rest. Be a generous gift, the one you give best. For you might as well let possession have you. After all, your whole existence is you. Thank you. Thank you. And one more piece. This one is by John S. Hall. He's the singer of King Missile. And this is the miracle of childbirth. No! There, there are no minors in the audience, are there? Good. The miracle of childbirth. Your father fucked your mother at least once. Your father fucked your mother while they were in bed, and your father got a heart on him. He stuck it inside your mother, and they fucked. Ew! Sometimes, maybe your father fucked your mother in the ass, or maybe on the night you were conceived. Maybe they did that before or after, or maybe they didn't. Maybe your father never fucked your mother's ass, but on the night that you were conceived, one thing is certain. Your father fucked your mother in her cunt. Maybe, maybe your father sucked your mother's clit, and, and maybe your mother sucked your father's dick. Uh, maybe your father... You know, stuck a finger or two up your mother's slit until she got really wet. Maybe he got his whole hand up there. If you have older brothers or sisters, then your father probably could have gotten his whole hand up there. If not, then maybe not. But at some point, your mother was wet and loose enough to accommodate your father, and they fucked. Maybe they did it doggy style. Maybe your mother got on top of your father. Maybe your parents liked to talk dirty to each other when they were fucking. Maybe your mother screamed, oh daddy, oh daddy, fuck me, daddy, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. And maybe your daddy screamed, here it comes, here it comes, get ready, bitch, here I come. And maybe your mother said, come at me, come at me, come at me, oh God, oh yeah, baby, fuck your mommy, fuck your mama's sweet pussy, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Or maybe they were very quiet. <laughs> but at any rate... Eventually your father came and sperm shot out of his dick and it went up your mother's cunt and fertilized her egg and that was you. That was you in your mother's womb growing like a fetus for nine months, making your mother fatter and fatter, making her sick, making her vomit, making her hate your father for doing this to her, making her hate you, this thing inside of her like a virus growing and sucking like a leech attached to her, sucking her blood, drinking her like a vampire fetus growing and sucking and growing until one day you want out and you burst through the snotty membrane and out you pop of your mother's cunt all covered with blood and a bloody umbilical cord still attaches you to the inside of your mother somewhere until someone snips it off and you are severed. You are a separate being. This is the miracle of childbirth. To some it is proof that there is a God. Now, after you were born, maybe you sucked milk out of your mother's tit. Maybe your father wiped the shit off your shitty ass. I don't know. You'll have to ask them. But that is basically the way people are born, in a nutshell. That is it. Unless you were a test tube baby, which you weren't. So, let's face it. 
your father fucked your mother, and the next time you're fucking somebody, just try to keep that in mind. 